So we're going to make the butterfly and we're muted, but you can unmute yourself for a question, but we're gonna paint this, right? And we have um, these paints that I give you in the little cups and two paint brushes. And this is a big paintbrush and an itty bitty baby paintbrush, right? And she looks like a small paintbrush until I push hard and then she'll open, watch, smash. And then she's a big paintbrush, right? And that's folding it all the way over so I can push my paint, right? And then we have a little paintbrush for doing little things. And basically, I'm not gonna, when I do the lines, I'm telling you early, is I just push my black paint like this, I just drive my car, and it's the exact size of a paintbrush. As long as I don't wiggle or scribble, it's one paintbrush thick, like that. Does that make sense? So you don't scribble when we make the lines. And that's how it comes out good. Scribbling is for crayons, pens, colored pencils, where the, the color comes out one tiny line at a time. So we go like this. You don't do that with paint unless you're mixing colors, okay? So you guys ready? Someone had a question, yes, Daniela? Question? Oh, oh there you are, yes? Do you, do you need to do more colors that you want? No, we're gonna do it just like this but you're gonna have all these colors left over and you'll be able to paint something later using everything you learned today. But if you follow with me, I'm gonna show you how to make it 3D, right? So it looks like bright, medium, dark, darker, darkest, 3D, okay? So no more questions, let's get, let's get started. Okay, so here's my, that's what the original looks like, right? Well, let's put it down here and this is what we all have. And we're gonna paint the background first Okay, so uh, can you mute? I think did I mute myself? <laughs> you mute him, I didn't. <laughs> what? What? You muted me. Oh, okay. So now we're gonna we need we're gonna do our background. Can you find this turquoise color? Right, turquoise. Everyone has it. And then just be careful when you take the lid off because it's on the lid. So we just go pop. And then red, because we can use the color in the lid, right? But of course, see, it got on me. Gross. So we're gonna outline with paint. So it's a weird idea. And we outline with our paintbrush, but we outline with the uh, edge of the paintbrush. So remember when I showed you, um, Axel, did you have a question? Axel, can you type it then? Um, oh, yes? What happens, if, what happens if we make a mistake? Oh, don't worry about it. You'll see. You'll see. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you the whole time. So if you're nervous, it means you're excited and your brain's about to learn anything. So no more questions. Let me show you stuff. So here's the big paintbrush. And remember when I went like this and it opened really, really big, right? Because I'm smashing it all the way. So if I smash my paintbrush like this, it goes Whoa, like that. But I actually don't outline with the whole paintbrush. I outline with one hair, right? So I go like this, and I'm gonna get my, I get, I stab my paint, and I go smash, and it opens really big. And then I sneak up, I sneak up, and one hair touches the line, and then I push, and I don't wiggle. I push like a bulldozer. Okay, so now we can get our turquoise and we get our turquoise and we just, and don't, don't stab it like a crazy person. Just go poke like that. Uh oh, look at the drip. Careful. Poke. Okay, now watch me. Everyone watch. I'm going to go above it like this and I go smash. Oh, and then I push down, down, down. I'm touching. And now I push, and I'm watching one, it's all painting, but I'm only watching one hair. Oh, it turned dry. Should I let it stay dry? Should I wiggle? No, I just get a poke more paint, and I go back over it, and I just go push. Oh, because it's smoother that way. Want to see that up close? Watch me. Okay, now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to land above it, right? And I just go poke. And then I sneak down. Oh, I touch it. 
and I push. Did I wiggle? Did I pick up my paintbrush? Uh-uh. I just let one hair do all the work. The rest of the paintbrush makes a line. Who cares? But I let one hair touch it. Now you do it. See if it's true. Axel, ask me again. Ask what? Ask me a question. I know. I've been asked Miss Naomi. Oh, yes? Go ahead. Oh, Miss Naomi, can you play up? Um, is, see? Is that her name? Yeah. Yeah? Um, can you put Miss Bixie on the spotlight? She is on spotlight, honey. Can I can't you see it. Can you pin me? Pin. I can. I'm trying to click you. Okay, how about we do more, right? Who found that their paintbrush dried really fast and you had to go over it again? So, you know where the paint is? You just go poke. Now I'm going to do this other side and I go above the line, land, and then, oh, it's dripping. And I push down. I touched it. Now I'm just going to ride the roller coaster down. Oh, it only lasted like three fingers and then it got dry. Oh, well, I just get more paint. Oh. And I just go, wee, oh, a drip. I'm just gonna use my finger and wipe it off and put it on a napkin. There, why? Because I'm gonna paint all that other stuff. And look at, what if you get some on your butterfly? Look everybody, what do we go back over it with? Black. So if you get some on your butterfly a little bit, we're gonna fix it with black paint, so. No worries. Oh, now I have to go down the side. Where's my paint? Oh, there it is. <gasps> okay. Oh, it's so drippy. Now I'm going to go I land next to it. Smash. And I sneak up to it. One hair. And it only lasts like four fingers. And then I run out of paint. That's okay. More paint. Land. Smoosh. More paint. See how it doesn't last very long. And I don't wiggle and scribble. I just go land because I'm outlining and I only want one hair to do it for me. We're going to do the whole butterfly. So if you feel confident, you just keep going. And then I'm going to go stamp. Now I'm going to do the other side. I go above it, smash. And I touch one hair. Oh, ran out of paint. Who feels good about that? How come you can outline so good? Because you've been handwriting your whole life. This is a skill you already have. And then I just go step. And we're making a perfectly one inch thick bit per perfect uh, protection barrier. We're protecting our butterfly. So when we fill it in, scribbly, 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 we won't hurt our butterfly. Because when you outline something, your brain won't let you go over the line. That's why we do it. So we go, stab, I'm almost done, I'm beating you. Mine's almost outlined it and yours isn't. Now I'm gonna do the bottom, they're like smiles. Wee, swipe, I missed, one more time, swipe. Now I have to go around her tail. No, it's not a tail, huh? Butterflies have thoraxes. I'm checking because I'm beating you. Some of you are painting the whole background. All we need is an outline first. Silly billies. Now I'm going back. I can see as it starts to dry, there are weird see-through parts in my, what is the white doing showing through? Well, it's acrylic paint, right? Remember I told you it was plastic paint? Well, as it dries, if it's thin, it starts to tear. Acrylic paint is very weird. It's why it happens on your wall when you try to paint at home. But I can go back and just go second coat right there. I can see it peek through right there. I can see it peek through right there. Fixie, fixie, smashy, smashy. Don't you dare peek through and there. 
Okay, now that I have an outline, who thinks it's going to be really easy to, to paint the rest of it? So easy. Right? But I'm not going to use the tip of my paintbrush, and I, I'm just going to go smack, right? And it's almost like I'm using the side of my paintbrush, right? So everybody pause and look up. I'm going to show you. Here's my piece of bread, and here's my butter. I'm going to butter my bread. <laughs> That's too sharp. It'll just cut the, but what if I use the side of the paintbrush and peanut butter it on, right? So now when I get my paintbrush, I actually hold it almost um, horizontal, more flat, not straight ahead like a pencil, too pokey. The side, and then I push it around like that. And I just go, more paint! And then I go, put a smoothie, smoothie, and it doesn't last very long. The paint gets thin and dry really fast. So I just go, more paint. We have a question. Go ahead. Yes. It's not a question, but I kind of want to Oh, uh, uh, you're worried about the um, orange part that you already did? Well, it should be dry when we start, right? This little part will be dry, and we'll just paint over it like it never happened. No worries. Yeah. Just like if you painted your wall and it was dry and you painted it again, it paint over it. Oh, I gotta get more. Look, more, more paint. You know what I'm doing that I forgot to say? I get my paint like this and then I just touch it to the edge of my cup so that little string lets go. And then I go. <laughs> Anyone doing that? Anyone catch that? I didn't say it out loud. But I realize I'm, oh, listen to how dry that is, you guys. Let me put it next to the microphone. <coughs> There's no paint. It should be slippery and slimy paint. Let me get more. Okay. Oh, smooth, smooth, because there's more paint. Wiggly, smushy, smashy, smushy, smashy. Who has little white parts trying to peek through? What if we just agree we're going to have to paint the background twice? Let's just paint it one time because look at mine. I'm supposed to be professional, right? Look at mine. Look at the, um, can you see the dumb white part? <laughs> look at there. Whatever. I'll paint it twice. It can't be helped, right? Acrylic paint is liquid plastic. So wherever it's thin is a little bit see-through. So we go, well, I'll just do it twice. I don't care. It doesn't bother me. And I'm, I'm smashing hard with my paintbrush because it opens and gets really big. Yes, um, J uh, Jasleen? Boop, boop. Um, I was going to ask, uh -huh. do we have to follow your design or your own? Uh, I would appreciate if you do because I have, I have, uh, it's called color design that I know how to mix all the colors called color theory. So we don't make any ugly colors. So if you follow along, this is a, um, a monarch butterfly, but tomorrow, if you want to paint it different, you could paint over it cause it will be dry. Right? Yeah. It's not precious. Mm -hmm. This isn't precious, right? We decide what it's worth. So if you want to paint it over tomorrow, but if you follow along with me, you're learning tricks while you follow along, and then you can use your own colors tomorrow maybe with what you've learned so far. Is that fair? So what if you have other colors at home? I don't know. I'm almost done. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Who's beating me? I bet you are. Me has a question. May I do a question? Question. Beating you. Oh, you just wanted to tell me that? All right, fine. Okay, now look at mine. Just everybody pause and look up. Look at those weird, they're called holidays. Can you see them? I bet you can't whatever but they're little white dots like what the what i can't ah uh. so second coat i painted it all now i'm gonna go hunting now i go hunting for all the little white spots so i get my white paint i'm like all right then there is some 
and this part right here and I couldn't see it when I was painting it because I thought I did a good job but once it starts drying you're like what why is the paint doing that I don't know all paint does it but oh I dripped on my butterfly eh, I'm gonna paint over my butterfly I don't care because I was throwing the paint up there too fast and it fell off my paintbrush whoops Oh, there's one right there. I see that white thing. I'm gonna go hunting. And the light is reflecting on my shiny paint. It's hard to see. But that part is, yeah, yeah. Ooh, second coat is smoother. I like it. It's, it's more, it's a, a, a better color too. And if you notice, when you put the brand new wet paint on, the dry paint, the dry paint is darker. Well, all paint darkens as it dries because it floats in a white gel that turns clear like Elmer's glue. So it gets darker, but it's not really getting darker. The gel's just disappearing. You ever go to Home Depot and order paint and it's white and you're putting color in the white? They already know that that white paint turns clear. Because I didn't. Ask me a question. Hmm? What? Did I just do the paint? Yeah, there's two paintbrushes. Two paintbrushes. Well, I didn't get one or two paintbrushes. That's my greatest fear come true. Check inside your uh, your paper towels. Sometimes they get stuck in there, right? Look in your bag. Because I dropped them in there and a, and a napkin can grab them. Oops, I got paint on my butterfly. Not in the napkins. They were in the napkins? Oh, okay. They were there? No, I mean, I am, I am, uh, I, I am eating a lady once. Um, yeah, let me see my, yeah, but what are you doing? Probably you I went hunting. Oh, sorry. Sorry. No, look, you go. I found a whole bunch of white spots. Who else did? Isn't that weird? We thought we painted it so good and then it starts to dry and you're like, what the heck? And you look close and you're like, no, get, what? And that, oh, and watch this. I, my, my, I have to pick up my painting a little bit because I can see that stuff on the, I, there. I forget about the, very, oh, look at how pure white it is right there in the corner. Psh. Get it, get it. Got that. Oh, that corner. Oop, oh, that. Okay. There. What's with this? Who feels good about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, if you want to save that paint when you're done, put that lid back on, clip. This will be good for painting rocks, right? You could put fish, make a fish out of a rock and stuff. So, you just put the lid on it because the air will steal the water out of it, right? And then, remember what I told you about uh, this being liquid plastic called acrylic paint? So if I just sat this on the table and let it dry, it turned a uh, hard plastic, right? Right now it's soft because it's wet. So I'm not going to let it evaporate. This is when the only thing I use this cup for is to rest this giant paintbrush so that I can, I can clean it easy. That's all I do. I'm just going to rest it in here. We're going to use the baby paintbrush next, but this is resting so it doesn't dry out and turn hard and make me mad. Cause we could use this paint, it's a good paintbrush. We could use it later. And then we're just resting a teensy bit, waiting for people to catch up with us. Look at you all clean, you're doing the little touchy touchies. I see everybody with the beautiful turquoise background. Do you guys wanna see why we love this painting? This is the color theory I was talking about, about why I already designed the painting, right? So we are doing, the inside of the butterfly is yellow, orange, and red, right here. 
Then what is directly across from yellow, orange, and red? Woo! Boink! Turquoise, right? So they're called contrast colors because purple and yellow are opposite. Orange or orange and blue are opposite. Green and red are opposite. We like them next to each other. But who's ever played with Play-Doh and it looked like a cat turd and you didn't want to play with it anymore, right? It's because you mixed. Oh, I'm putting purple with yellow. And then you mix it and it's like, whoa. Or the red and green. Oh, that's like Christmas. And then you mix them together and they're like, whoa, gross, right? You don't know. This is why, because opposite colors on the color wheel cancel each other out and make brown. Not brown you can paint a tree with, just like yeah, right? So our design, our design is high contrast of these colors on this side of the color wheel, opposite of turquoise. And then what else is opposite? Black and white are opposites. So our brain goes, oh, ooh, like that. That's called color theory. So if you made your own colors, whatever, that's totally fine, so fun, right? But I'm just showing you one idea, okay? And you're, when you guys are ready, put your, rest your big paintbrush in your big cup and we'll find our itty bitty baby paintbrush. Baby paintbrush. And we're gonna paint these windows. Wait, 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 wait. All these windows, right? They look like this. But we're gonna try to make 3D, right? So how many color values does it take for 3D? Three, right? Dark, medium, light, or maybe dark, medium, light. I don't know. So my light will be the brightest part. Here's her heart. And all the bright parts are, are the pointed towards her heart, right? And the farther away we get, the darker we get. And then there's orange. And then there's pink in the far away corners, right? Which is a red. She's actually a red. I call her pink, sorry. So she's red. Right? So I want 3D. But the trick is, I do not want to make a flag. Right? So here's my yellow, and then there's a line, and there's my orange, and then there's my red. Uh, no, it's not like, uh, what is that? That's a candy corn with the lines. No. What we want is no lines. So where yellow disappears into orange, and it's very disappearing. You can't, oh, where does pink start in the orange? You can't even tell, it's an oh, right? Oh, right here, bright yellow, then kind of a baby orange, and then it gets lighter and lighter, and or no, sorry, it gets darker and darker and darker and darker, right? That's what we're shooting for, right? Can't wait. So let's do a, the big, that one's big and that one's big, right? That one's bigger than that one, whatever. I never met this butterfly. So I need my white paint, so I just pop off the lid. Oh, let's pop off the lid of yellow, orange, and red, okay? And I'm gonna put them right together in a row on my table. You can't see my table from where you are. But I can't see your table either, so there. So I need my, now I'm gonna get my white first. Because what would be the brightest of um, white, yellow, orange, red, right? The white's the brightest. So I'm going to fill this with my baby paintbrush and I'm not going to hold it like a pencil. Ugh. I'm actually going to try to paint with the side. Remember I was telling you that with the, when we did the background? Using the side of it and just the side of it and pushing it around like that. Not straight ahead. Just the paintbrush actually opens like that when you go straight ahead. We want to use the side and be more peanut buttery, you know? So I'm going to fill this up halfway with white. So I'm just going to stab my white like I'm mad and get a glob with my baby paintbrush. Ooh. Ooh. That is like a lot and I don't care. And I find halfway, half fill it halfway. Oh, you can't see white on white, <laughs> right? You're like, what is she doing? I didn't see that. I got white paint. You can only tell because it's shiny, because it's wet. But I went like this halfway-ish, and then I just fill it all in, shiny, wet. And I get sopping wet with white. You Can you tell because mine is shiny? 
It's the only way, oh, there you can tell, sort of. And I fill it all the way to the bottom, 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 all the way to the bottom of the cone, like an ice cream cone. And I just want to make sure it's shiny and I filled it all in. I can see it. Oh, up to the edge. I missed the edge. Okay, got it. I'm, I don't want it on the black outline, but I'm not mad if it happens. I'm just trying to be careful. Look. Did you fill yours up halfway? Like a whole half of an ice cream cone? Like, like if it was a whole hand big, like right where the knuckles are, like, oh, right? Four fingers right in the middle. Huge, huge amount. You guys ready? Have you filled it in? Cause not, oh, we'll go slow and then we'll go faster. Why do we go slow? For learning. Cause this is earth and we have to learn by doing on earth. There's no way around it. Okay, now I'm gonna get yellow. Super bright yellow. It smells like paint. Oh, Lily has a question. Question. Are, are we supposed to paint it in the background? With we, the we already we already did the you mean this right here? We finished that. All done. But we're not supposed to paint with the white. The white goes in we're gonna fill up one of the windows, I call these windows because it reminds me of stained glass. <laughs> That's why I say that. But we fill it up halfway with white, all soaking wet with white. Did you do it? No, I'm still on that. Oh, and paint over whatever you did because it doesn't matter. Just paint yeah. over it. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to get yellow and I'm just going to stab it like an, my paintbrush is dirty and I don't even care. I just stab the yellow. Stab! I'm just gonna put it right on the white, but on the top of the, on the very top part of the white, and it makes like, oh my, I'm gonna put more, I'm gonna put two stabs, whoa, 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 whoa. you know why, because it's kind of big. This is what I did, you wanna see? So it's shiny, wet with white, right? Can you see it? Oh, I don't know if you can see it. Let me tell you, so it's shiny. And then I put the white, and it's going to make, like, lemon white. But watch! Now we're going to make it fade and disappear. So everybody pause and look up. So I'm going to go like this. And they're all going to connect. But I'm going to make this row. And then I grab, everybody watch. Don't look away. Look at me. Stop painting. I can see you. Stop painting. Oh, thank you. So I'm going to take this yellow, and I cut off half of that yellow. Right? And then I cut off that yellow and make it lower. But the whole time I'm trying to run out of yellow. So by the time I get near her heart, I ran out of yellow. So everybody pause. Watch me do it. All right. Don't, don't look away. Don't look away. Very yellow. I am very yellow. Scribble, 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 scribble. Now I cut that in half and try to go a row lower. I cut it in half and I go lower, lower. Oh, it's getting lighter. Can I get more yellow? No. I'm trying to run out of yellow. And I cut that in half and it's even lighter. And it's even lighter even still. And I'm totally running out of yellow. And it's just like baby, baby, baby yellow. So it's very yellow, not very yellow, running out of yellow, all gone, disappear. And I give it permission to do that. It's 3D on purpose. And then what happens if you keep going like this? You're just mixing it all together and making one color. How many colors are we rooting for? Three, dark yellow, medium yellow mixed with white, and ran out of yellow, almost pure white, right? But this is our first one, so it will be our ugliest one, okay? So I go, very yellow row, and then not very yellow row, running out of yellow, oh God, disappear. Who wants to make orange? Now I'm gonna get orange. Everybody watch. <gasps> Filthy paintbrush. Don't care. I just stab it like I'm mad. Boop. Now where I'm gonna put this? I'm gonna put it uh, just one row above the yellow, and I go little, 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 little. Hey, the yellow that was already in my paintbrush made a new color. Look, that's like two fingers big. I don't even care. I don't care. Orange. If you guys are cleaning your paintbrush all the time, don't bother. I'll tell you when it's time. 
Because remember how all these colors are friends? Look, on my color wheel, they're all friends. They won't make any ugly colors. Because we're going to stay right here. So don't worry. They won't make any ill colors. Okay, wait. Everybody pause. Now I'm going to clean my paintbrush. So I get a paper towel. And I'm going to lick it off. No, I'm not. You guys are crazy. I'm going to go like this. I'm just going to give it a pinch. And screw it. Don't use your water. How come? Our water is filthy. I just need a pinch. I just need that extra orange off. Get off my paintbrush orange. There. It's like orange boogie. Okay. No paint on my paintbrush. Remember the trick we did with the, with the yellow and made it disappear? Watch this. No paint on my paintbrush. Now watch. I'm going to scratch that down half, half of it and make it less orange than half of that. And ha Watch me. Everybody watch. Okay, let me bring it closer. So I go half of that. Oh. And then half of that. Oh, it's even softer. And half of that, it's totally disappearing. And then half of that, it turns into nothing. It's just nothing. So should I do it again? No. Dark orange, medium orange, running out of orange, disappear and mist. Was I doing it hard or soft, do you think? Soft, delicate decorating. Soft, soft, soft. It's just, just a row, and then a row disappearing, and then a row disappearing, building it in the row, like that. And I'm trying to run out of orange. Goodbye, orange. Get off my paintbrush. Who got a fade? Who faded? Who step gently disappeared and ran out all by itself? Right? Okay, this is our first one, so this is our ugliest one. Now, how about in the tippy toppy tippy top? The red. I call her pink, but she's pathantho red. I don't even know. So I go, stop! I just go, oh. And my paintbrush was filthy. I don't care. And I put it up here. Okay. Like, oh! There was orange in my paintbrush and the pink and orange made like missile pop color. That is so pretty. Stop it. No, you stop it. So pretty. Nice. Am I gonna just gonna let that pink sit there at the top and just look all boring like a little ice cream can? No, we're gonna do the fade thing. Want to see what I did? I just, it's just, it looks like a little box. It looks ridiculous. Like the top of an egg, right? Am I going to let it sit there like that? No. Orange and pink are touching. So two colors are touching. What should we do when two colors are touching? Make a mix. I'm going to clean my paintbrush. You know why? There's a lot of pink on my paintbrush and I would like it to disappear. So I just get a paper towel and go pinch like that. And then I go, okay, let me push the very bottom of the pink into the orange. Kind of like this. Pink and pink in my orange, orange in my pink and pink in my orange. <gasps> you can't see the line anymore. It's so pretty. It's like a fade. It goes dark, d lighter, 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 and it ran out. See, because I had no paint on my paintbrush when I took, and I sewed those two colors together. I put orange in the pink and the pink in the orange, orange in the pink, and then I'm done. What happens if I keep scrubbing? I just get one color. You know when you go to Starbucks and they put it in the blender and it all becomes one color? You're just like, uh, boring, right? Well, we don't want to make a boring color. We would like, we would, we don't want to scrub all these together. I just make, ugh. we could have stirred them together in one cup and made a color if that's what we wanted to do. Who wants to make another one? Who thinks the next one on that side will be way easier? I know. How come? Because we done one. Will it be that slow? Because we done one, right? So I'm going to give him a job. And I'm going to lick it. No. It's just, and I don't need to use my water in my cup because it's filthy. I just need to get the extra out and go pinch. And you know what else I pinch too? And I pinch. Like that, and it keeps it pointy. If I rub it really hard on my paper towel, it makes all our hair stick out. So I just go pinch, and I just get the extra out. Whatever. And now, 
Who knows what's going to happen on this side? You can predict. How come you can predict? Because we done it. So what was the first color? White. Right? And we fill it halfway with white. Do you trust yourself? We've done one. Right? So your brain's like, oh yeah, lady, I got this. Right? So I just, and I just stab my white because I need a lot. And my paper's is a little dirty. But we're all making a new color. It doesn't matter. Stab! And find halfway. Remember how you couldn't see it? You'll see it this time because my paper is a little dirty. Ooh. And then I just go, ooh, I'm all over my black lines. I was a little aggressive. I need to calm down. <laughs> and then fill it in with white. Get more white. Stab! So it's nice and thick with the white. Fill it up halfway. Nice. 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 I feel, can you see it? Mine's, because now it's a little dirtier. You can see it better, right? Because it had a little in my paintbrush and I went halfway and I scribble, scribble, falling down, down, down towards her heart, 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 down, 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 scribble. I'm not trying to cover up my black, but I don't get mad if I accidentally get some on there on my black lines. Now, who remembers what happens next? Dirty paintbrush, yellow paint. I just stab my yellow stab, right? And where does it go? On top of the white, but at the top of the white pile. So I just go little, 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 drop it off, drop it off like a giant booger. Get off my paintbrush, you. There. See, look how much I put. Oh my God, it's practically dripping. I don't care because I'm going to do that fady thing with it. Oh, that's okay. You got some on the black? Watch me. Look, if I get some on my black, I can use my finger and just tell her to calm, get off. Right? I just don't want it to be so thick. It won't hurt nothing. Just wipe it off like it's jelly on the counter and just go, smear it off with your finger and get the extra off. Because we're going to paint over it. Look, they're all the same. So, oh, I got a little bit on there. Look, look, it's going to be orange right there, right where you're pointing anyway, right? So now I'm going to push that yellow down. How many rows is it? I don't remember. Oh, I need to clean my paintbrush. Look how much yellow is still on there, dumb. Okay, pinch. Okay, there, pinch. Now I'm going to go and cut that, put half, like I get the bottom half of it, right? The bottom half, and I go wiggly, 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 oh. Now it's lighter, like a baby, baby yellow. And I get half of that. Whoa, I'm not adding more yellow. I'm giving it permission to run out. It's totally running out of yellow. It's totally running out. And then it disappeared. <sighs> Very yellow. And when it dries, it's even more yellow. Because the white is distracting. But it's very yellow because it's thick yellow. Then less yellow, yes, little less, 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 right now. Who did that better that time? How come? Because you did it already. You have a human brain, and human brains only learn by doing. If you watched me do it, would you be a better painter? No, your brain must do things. If you watch the teacher do math, do you know how to do math? When do you actually learn the math? You do it, right? And then your brain goes, oh, I get it. But not watching someone do it. Okay, now I'm going to put orange, okay? And just two fingers of orange floating above, just above the yellow. And I just go, stop. I always leave the top for what? For red. And if you're, because I keep pinching my paint, my paint, paintbrush on the napkin. If it gets too gross, get another one. I don't care. So I'm going to clean my paintbrush pinch. Okay. Now it's just some orange left on there. You ready to make a, a, a fade and try to run out of orange? Does it make sense this time? Okay. And if you got here late and you haven't done the background, I, I'm making a YouTube video, remember, and you can watch it and do the background later. No biggies, no biggies. Okay, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna cut this bottom of the orange halfway and push it into the yellow and go down, down, down. Oh, that's pretty. 
I already love that better this time. Oh, it's got stripes. I like it. And then I cut that one in half. Le oh, less, less. Oh, wait, stop. Look it, look it. It's not disappearing like this side. I'm gonna clean my paintbrush again. I think I have too much orange on my paintbrush. What? Look it. One, one more time. One more time. Pinch. Because I'm trying to run out and it wasn't running out. Let me try. Okay. Now I'm gonna touch the very, very bottom of this one. Look, it's too. It's not matching, right? So if I take, I now no paint on my paintbrush. Oh, now it's a baby amount. I was pushing too. Okay. I had too much orange on my paintbrush. Calm down. I had to tell my paintbrush, calm down. There was too much orange. But I noticed right away before I kept going. I was like, whoa, it's not stopping. It's supposed to disappear at the bottom, right? Like a sunset. Now I'm going to lick my paintbrush. No. I get a paper towel. What goes at the tippity top? Red, red. Okay. And I have to go step. And decorate the tippity top. Pinky, pinky, pink. Ooh, pink and orange are touching. Can't wait. I'm going to make magic. Doesn't the red and orange look so good together? Don't they make a good color? It's like I never would have thought it, but once you see them together, it's just like the color wheel. Of course they go together. They're right next to each other on the color wheel. And then I clean my paintbrush off. Why? Because I'm going to do a disappear blending moment. And pink and orange are touching, and it looks like a flag because it came to a perfect stop right there. It just goes, stop. That is so boring, right? So I'm just going to go, no paint on my paintbrush, and put the right where they touch. I put the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange, orange and the pink and the pink and the orange. <gasps> now you can't see. It just disappeared. It became soft. Right? Who feels good about that? How's your brain? Don't, what? How did you learn how to do that in just two windows? I showed you two times and your brain already understands it. What? You just did highlighting and shadowing. So highlighting is going brighter and shadowing is going darker. See? You did that. Nice job. So guess what happens now? We do all the windows. Do you need my help anymore? No. But I'm still going to say all the words because some people do like to listen and do it. But it's, how come it, mine looks 3D? Because I gave it permission to be brightest. Here's her heart. The brightest is closer to her heart, always, always. Then it becomes softy, misty. Then it gets darker as it goes farther away, right? I'm gonna keep doing it, but clean my paintbrush. Nope. Peach. Okay, now I'm gonna fill the next one halfway. This one's laying down on her side. So I stab my white a lot, because I fit. And I filled it in halfway. Where's halfway? Okay, there's halfway. And then fill it in closer to her heart, closer to her heart, closer to her heart. Okay. I got some on my black, but I'm being careful. A little. And we don't use our water. How come? How come we don't use our water, people? Because water is a solvent. So if that drip escapes from your paintbrush and slides down your painting, all the paint comes off. Does that make sense? It's happened to me. So we don't clean our paintbrush. We're just gonna use paper towel and go pinch. Okay? Try to remember that because it's it's a sad story when it happens. Okay, then I get the yellow and I go stab. And where does the yellow go? Right on top of the white. It's gonna be very yellow, right? Now I'm gonna try to cut it in half. It takes like four or five rows. And I'm gonna cut that in half. So, oh yeah, I have to clean my paintbrush. Give it a little pinch, pinch. Cause I just want the extra off. There, I'm always forgetting that. And then I cut that in half. Little, 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 little. Ooh, it's good. I love it when it turns baby yellow like that. And then less yellow. 
and even less yellow, and only what's left on my paintbrush disappearing misty. 3D just using yellow. And then I'm gonna do my orange. They're getting smaller, so I think I'm only gonna need one poke of orange. Poke! And I fill it in next to that yellow. That's gonna be the very dark, dark orange. And then I clean my paintbrush. Remember, because I'm trying to run out of orange. And if I leave this big glob of orange on there, I won't run out. It won't turn into that misty, pretty, pretty moment when it disappears. So I just go pinch, buy extra orange. And I cut that in half. La, 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 la. And cut that in half. And it should be disappearing by now. I might have to clean my paintbrush. Yeah, I'm gonna clean my paintbrush. It wasn't, I, there, now I'm gonna try again. Oh, it's way softer. I had too much orange on my paintbrush. Missed. It's a hard trick to learn, but it's just, I can tell I'm pushing too much orange and I want it to stop, so I just go, pinch. <laughs> Who feels like it's magic and you're just watching it happen? Isn't it just like you're like, you're, you're like just the observer. It's your hand, but you're just going, whoa. It does do it. That's amazing. Now I'm going to get my red. Poke. And I fill in the, like the top of the ice cream cone. Ooh, pink and orange are touching. I clean my paintbrush so I can use a no paint paintbrush to blend. Look at So orange and pink are touching. So I push the Orange and the pink and the pink and the orange, orange and the pink and the pink and the orange, like bridges. Like I make bridges, I push and pull and push and pull and push and pull. <gasps> New color happened. Nice. Who feels confident? Who's doing it all by themselves, no helpsies? Who's following along with me step by step? Both are good. Both are fine right? If you feel like you're quick, 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 it means you're probably going to be one of those people who are get really bored waiting for us to catch up with you doing the black, right? Just don't move ahead on the black because I have tricks. So you just rest if you beat us, okay? So now I'm going to get the white. Oh, I'm going to fill this. Are you guys, uh, who's on this part? Am I beating you? I see. Okay, so now I'm going to fill this one halfway with the white. Same story different window. Stop! Halfway. Fill it in. Do you, do you want to know what mastery is? This first one was for learning. Eh. The second one, you were doing really good. The third one, you're like, I totally got this. By the time you guys get down here, you'll be so bored. Do you know that's how math works? You have, you have 10 problems, right? The first one's really hard in the homework and it's making you mad. Second one's hard, hard. Then you start to figure it out and then you're like, oh my gosh, I'm so bored. I already figured it out and you still have five more to go. That's this. Your brain figures it out and it's already bored. Already learned it. Like that. I can't wait till you get to that point. It's the best part. Suddenly you feel that bored feeling come on. It's like, that's because you learned it. And you own it, and no one can take it from you. There, I filled it with white. Oh, I lost yellow. Oh, there she is. And I stab my yellow. Stop! And then I put it on top of the white. And then I cut that in half and try to get it to run out. Remember, if you're putting water in your paintbrush, make sure it's dry. I don't want those drips escaping and making you mad. It has happened to me, and you're going to be mad and think it's my fault, but I warned you. Just because I said there's water in front of you doesn't mean you play with it. Okay, now I clean my paintbrush. Pitch! Ooh! Ooh, orange! I like to do the fade, and it looks like a sunset. Who's getting into that disappearing moment with the orange? I know. Now I get the orange step, and it goes above the yellow. They're kind of laying on their side now. Oh. I clean my paintbrush because there's too much orange. I'm trying to run out of orange, so I try to get rid of the extra. And I cut that in half. 
this little lighter orange and cut that in half. And this is when I check and make sure I'm running out. Maybe even clean my paintbrush again because I'm trying to run out. Running out, running out, disappearing, turning to mist, gone. Good job. Check in with your brain. Is your brain relaxed? Exploring, full of wonder, right? You're like, hmm, mm, curious, mm, interesting, right? A relaxed brain. Okay, now I'm gonna do the top where the ice cream cone goes, the little tippity top. She's red. Poke. I fill it in. Is anyone going ahead without me? Oh, yes, question? Do we have a question? Juan, yes, question? Now click yourself. Juan, did you have a question? Miss Naomi, I think Juan has a question. Can you hear me? Yeah, I unmuted him, but I don't know. I don't know if he was kicked Oops. out because I don't see him. Juan, do you have a question, honey? Well, the other one. One that I'm muted. Oh, yeah. Juan Murray. Yeah. Okay. Just chime in whenever you get it unstuck. Okay, now my orange and my pink are touching. So I put the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange. I bet you guys didn't even wait for me right then, huh? Because you already know what to do. You just go. If you know what to do, you just keep going. You don't need me. What are teachers for? To help you learn something you don't know. So what happens after you know it? You just keep going. You have mastered it, right? Ooh, what about this one? More? Okay, so I'm gonna fill it with white. Halfway, stab! Halfway, oh, she's so big. Oh, Juan, I can hear you now. Juan, Juan Ramirez, Juan Ramirez, go ahead and say your question. Um, um, I need a knee. I need a leaf with my, I said the best thing I know about me. Okay, um, you can ask me the leaf and my cup's in the bag. Okay. Yeah. You can tell him. Oh, yeah. So I'm recording this on YouTube at the same time. So just put the lids on all your paints, right? And wash your paintbrushes, make them smooth. And then tomorrow when you get the, you can start wherever you left off and just keep painting. It won't hurt nothing. Okay, just you you don't want your paint brushes to dry with this paint on it. Okay, clean, clean, clean. Okay, now I'm filling this. Who's beating me? You guys are beating me, huh? Look at you guys go. You don't need me. Um I have a question. question. What color do you want like on the circle ones. The circle oh, here? Let me show you. Mm -hmm. They look like little fires. So I fill it up halfway going up with white. And then I put the yellow and I climb it higher, 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 higher. Then I put the orange and go higher, 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 higher like that. So they look like little fires. So they're kind of upside down. I'm almost there. I'll show you one, okay? You're beating me by a lot. I'm doing too much talking. I'm going to get to painting. Okay, so now I'm going to fill it with the white, the yellow. Oh, that wasn't enough. I had just white on there. Yellow. And then I cut that in half. And that in half. And that in half. And that in half. And that one definitely looks like an ice cream cone. <laughs> okay, then clean my paintbrush pitch. So I'm going to go get orange. I put the orange above the yellow. Scribbly, 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 scribbly. And clean my paintbrush. I always just want to get rid of more paint because I'm trying to make it disappear. So I just go pitch. Now I'm going to cut that orange in half. Oh, look at mine's disappearing fast. Oh, I think I did this one my best. How come this one is my best one? Because I did it one, two, three, four times. And that's how Earth is. That one was for learning. That one was for understanding. Figuring out. Almost got it. Nailed it. Earth. 
by the human brain. Okay, now I get my pink, sew it at the top, and pink and orange are touching. I get to make a new color where they're friends. Clean my paintbrush. Now I'm gonna put the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange and orange and the pink and the pink and the orange and orange and the pink. And the orange and the pink. <gasps> That is my best one. Cause I did it four times, five times. Now, can you, are you guys, now, okay. Um, who was the one that asked me about the circles? Tanya? Okay, watch. I'll tell you. So, I mean, these are the same as these, right? But who's ready for the circles on the bottom? Speedy Gonzalez's, right? So watch, I'll show you one of these just in case. So I'm gonna do one in the middle. I just go stab. Right? But I feel it halfway going up, 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 up towards our heart, towards our heart. And I filled it with white. And I get the yellow. It's the same tricks, but I'm going up like a fire. So pretty. And I go poke with the yellow. And I go on top of the white. Oh, hey, that barely showed. Oh, I know why. Look at There's white in my yellow, and I must have stabbed a white spot. Okay, try again. Okay, very, that's better. And now I'm gonna push that up higher, and higher with the yellow, and then a little higher. It's running out, it's disappearing with the yellow. I'm running out, oh God. Now I can put the orange, hook. And the orange goes under this yellow. Now I'm gonna clean my paintbrush because I'm gonna try to do the magic fade, pinch. So I go up, then cut that in half a little higher, up, 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 scribbly, running out, running out, turn to mist. Fire, looks good like fire. Now I do the red, poke. And then I get to put the pink and the orange and the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange. Was that good? Did you see me do it, Tanya? And that, okay, so it's just like an upside down version of these ones. These ones were on their side, and these ones are upside down. Oh, I just put my finger in it. Don't put your finger in it. Uh, like that. Let me put my napkin here so I can reach it more often. There. So you, who's beating me? You guys have both sides done? Oh, what? What? Now you're doing those? You guys are doing so good. You just don't even wait for me. Just go, just go. Okay, now I have, I have one, two, three, four, five, six done. I think, is that halfway? I don't know, it feels halfway. Now I'm gonna fill this one with, the little get white, and I go, stab! Find halfway. Have you have some question, mommy? Nevian, you have some question? Nevian. Give me a second, let me have them on you. Mm -hmm. Okay, then you're resting. Don't go ahead and do the black parts yet, because I have tricks for that, and I don't want it to turn a big smear of black. So you, can you take a little rest? Just rest. A rest, a nice rest. So, Oh, and by the way, there's two kinds of students in every class. Those that go really fast and they get bored and get in trouble for talking and stuff. And then those that go really slow and they panic and freak out because they don't have enough time. You are both kind of students, depending on what subject it is. I freak out over math. I can't, oh, right? First one done in English, because it's easy for me. Done, bored, doodling. And then the math, <laughs> right? Because that's not my fave. So if you're all done, it means it was very easy for you. Your brain was like, no big deal. You rushed right through it, whatever, right? Other people, delicate, delicate. Both are perfect, right? Both are fine, okay? Okay, now I'm gonna get my yellow. I'm gonna fill it in. i put it on top of my white, pook. And then I get to push closer and closer to her heart and try to run out of yellow. I go, scribble, scribble, push, 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 push. And then a little bit closer, push, 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 push. <gasps> running out, running out, running out, oh God. 
You guys finding it easier and easier? Then I get my orange. It's called mastery when your brain learns it and you get, who's getting bored yet? Is your brain going, oh, I already know this. Congratulations, you've learned it. Now I go orange step. Some people actually get afraid of the bored moment. Like, oh, I'm so bored. This is so boring. Because you're smart. Now I go, okay, half the half of this orange, I'm gonna push closer to her heart and closer and disappearing and disappearing and turning into mist. Oh, this one's my best one now. How come it's my best one? Because I learned so much. <gasps> I like that one. <laughs> now I get my red pook into the top. It feels like you're getting good at it as you do it. Each one gets a little more smart, a little more clever, a little more interesting to look at. Hmm. Because this is the earth. That's how it works here. Oh. Ooh. Look what I did. I don't know why. I like this one. Look at all the little scratchy marks of different versions of color. I don't know. I like the texture. Fun. And then, okay, now I fill the next one with white. You guys are beating me. I have to go faster. I have to stop talking. Okay, lots of white. Fill it in halfway. Okay, now I can get the yellow. Yellow time. And I get it to fade. Less, 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 less. Disappear. Mmm. Another good one. I can tell when I'm doing better and I can tell that I'm softer with my paintbrush than I was when I started and I trust how much paint to get. It just happened naturally. Nobody explained it. I just understood it by doing it. Now I get my orange book. Oh, I didn't clean my paintbrush first. That's a huge amount of orange. Whoops. See, shouldn't brag because now I messed up. Okay, now I'm gonna do half that orange and half and disappearing and misty and faded. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Now I put the pink. Oh, no, not pink. I'm supposed to say red. Red. And then make red and orange be friends. And I put the red and the orange, orange and the red and the red and the orange. You guys are beating me. I can tell. You're already on the bottom ones? Uh, uh. Okay, I'm gonna go faster. Mm -hmm. Decorate, decorate. Can you imagine using three other colors to do this? Dark, medium, light, fade one color into another color. Curious, curious, you guys should play with these colors on rocks. I have, I have rocks in, in my yard that are like that, and I wash them and I decorate them, just for no good reason except for it, it's funner than TV. And then if you go on a walk, you leave them on people's yards, like a, a hello, like magic fairy rocks. And you could put nice sayings on them with a marker. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a good fade. Look at that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Who has a favorite one? Do you have a favorite one that you like? That one came out. That one is a good one right there. Mm -hmm. I like making new colors. Where two colors touch, that's my fave. Pinch. Now I'm doing the bottom ones. I'm looking. Oh, look at yours. Destiny, what? Wait for me. Don't go. Wait. We have to do the black together. Oh, look at yours. Okay, Andrea is exactly with me. And Margaret's is matching me. But Destiny has to wait. And look, at you guys have to. Because you were so fast. You have to wait for us to catch up with you. Ugh. Okay, wait. Now I get to make the little flames though. I like the fire. Who has a question, T uh, Tanya? Tanaya? Yeah. 
Go ahead. Oh, you mean to try try to do all of them at once? All do, white, like do all the whites and all the yellow. Here's the here's a warning about that. I would do maybe four at a time. Cause you know how? Look at this one's dry, right? They're, it's all dry. These dry really fast, and if the paint's dry, you can't mix new colors in it. But how about if we do four at once? I'll do it with you, but I have to skip this one that I already did, right? So I'll get the white. That's a good idea. Who thinks it's a good idea for going faster? Do you recommend? I, I take that recommendation. So, okay, so I'm gonna fill that one halfway with white and that one halfway and skip that one. And then halfway and then, but I'm going up, right? So I have to fill up with white, up, up. <gasps> They're like Easter eggs on fire. I don't know. This is right, yep. And then up, but only four. And then I could get the yellow, do the, all the yellows at the same time. Poke. Yellow. Poke. Yellow. Poke. This is faster. Excellent recommendation. Excellent. And I clean my paintbrush pinch. And I could push this one up row after row so I run out of yellow at the tipsy topsies. So I'm going to push it up, 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 up. Get half of that and half of that. And run and push it up, 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 Time. Super fast. And I already know how to do it so good, you know? I go higher and higher and higher. And I gotta put orange, boop. Orange, orange, orange. And clean my paintbrush pinch. Higher, higher. Uh oh, it's not running out. I need to clean my paintbrush so I run out faster. Pinch. Okay. Oh, better. Okay. Higher, 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 higher. Okay. Higher. Who feels like you're really understanding how to fade and disappear one color into another color? Aren't you doing a good job? It's very nice. I get my red, put it on the bottom, 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 bottom. And now pink and orange are touching. So I clean my paintbrush and try to sew them together. I put the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange and the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange. Scribbly, 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 push and pull. Blah, 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 blah. Fire! My eggs are on fire. Now I get to do all these four at the same time. We're trying to go fast. You can catch up. Ooh, look at lilies. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Gorge. Gorgeous. Yep. Don't do the black yet. Wait for me. I have tricks. Wait, Kylie. I have tricks. Where I'm only like five minutes from catching up with you, I have tricks about the black, okay? Wait for me because I have tricks about making nice, smooth lines, okay? So just rest. Wait for me to catch up. It's about five minutes, okay? Just a tiny recess, okay? Now I'm going to get my white. I'm going to fill up. I'm going to fill, fill half of them with the white. I'm going to do all four. But I don't want to hurt my black lines, right? I don't want to hurt my black. So I go step, halfway, 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 more white, halfway. Form properties uh, Start a trial now on us. Miss Pixie? Yes, question. Look it. Show me, show me. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Look at it. What? I'm seeing some proud, some proud moments. Your brain was really working because you could do, by the time you were done, were you bored? Did you really, really learn it? Yeah. Yeah. And by, yes. Yeah, this is fun. Now I'm going to give this to my mom. Oh, she's going to love it. And do you notice how at first you're like, oh no, I'm going to ruin it. I'm going to ruin it. And then your brain relaxes and you're like, here. 
Do you know how to weld? Can you weld two pieces of metal together? How about if somebody showed you and you did it like 10 times? Then you'd know how. You don't know how now, but you do it and then you know how, right? So you're like, I don't get it. I don't get it. And then you do it and you're like, oh, I get it. But you can't know until after you've done it. It's a, it's a trick of earth. It's earth, how earth is set up. I don't know. Now I'm going to do my yellows. Yellow, 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 yellow. Yellow, 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 yellow. Oh, because now I'm going to make them fade. Are you already done, Margaret? Um, yeah, but you... do I put the tiny paintbrush in the water? Uh, you, no, you don't have to. You can just let you, uh, we're going to do black right away. It won't have enough time to dry out. It's just the big one we put in there because if we waited, it would be all rock hard by the time our class was over. And I didn't want you to have to throw that paintbrush away. Okay, now I'm going to go higher. Higher. Yes, question. Can I show you? Um, yes, please. Line? Yes. Show me, show me. This is mine. Oh, look at it. Do you have a favorite one? One that really had lots of texture and color that you were very impressed with? Yes. See? And you're like, if you try, oh, that's, it is gorgeous. Look at the color change. And it's so gentle, like a, like a tiny little sunrise. So could you imagine doing this with a lot of paint and slowly making a sunrise and making the colors disappear into each other? Right? That's how it would be done. Now I have to do my orange. Who's beating me? I'm almost done. Okay. Orange, 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 orange. Oh. Okay, there's no orange on the last one. Clean my paintbrush. Now I push up, 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 uh oh, not running out. It's less paint. Mrs. Pixie, yes. did you do some unicorn paintings I did? Oh, you did unicorn paintings? Oh, look at them. They're adorable. They're so pretty. I love them. Did you pick it to pick your colors? Because uh, look, you're on this side of the color wheel. Right? You chose the purples and the blues, right? So you stayed on yeah. this side of the color wheel right here. If you jump across, they make kind of poo-poo colors. But if you stay next to each other or in this family or in this family, they won't make any ew colors. Mm -hmm. Look at these ones. These ones are more fire-like than these ones. I like this. They get better as I do them. Pink. Pink. Then I get to put the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange and the orange and the pink and the pink and the orange. <gasps> okay, who beat me? Is everybody waiting? Y'all beat me. But I was going fast. Okay. So who, who's still working on their windows? Okay, so Rihanna, you need, you, you're going to work on yours? Anyone else? And uh, uh, Ezekiel, you're working on yours? What do you think? Um, like three minutes, five minutes? We'll rest. We'll, we'll take a rest and we'll wait. Because this, look at, look at our paintings. Look how much we have left. Just the black and the white. Now look at that. And you're like, oh, I like it. Now look at it with the black and white and the high contrast. Oh, it changes it. It changes the whole mood. Bold, right? Changes the mood of it. Oh, and I have tricks about these dots. So don't go blah, 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 like that. There's, there's tricks. Okay, don't spaz with the dots. I know what we can do while we're waiting. Can, can you get a fresh paper towel and clean your, um, your paintbrush that's in your cup? Right? She's been resting in water. She's soaking wet. Just give her a twist. And look at all that water. It's paint. 
with water and she's mostly clean. You know why? Because water is a solvent, which means it comes apart, makes paint come apart. But if we let it dry, it'd be hard and look at this. You can hear my, my can you hear it tap? The paint on my on my cover on my apron is hard. So we did not let it dry. Mm, all clean. Question. Birthday, really? Yeah, and she's gonna turn 16 and the fish. Oh, it's perfect. Wait till you put the black on it. You're gonna scare yourself how good it is. And Ezekiel, are you finished? Did you make it? Book. Oh, uh -huh. Oh, it was. How are you? You're 15 now? <laughs> no? Well, I'm eight. Eight. So you've been alive in the universe for eight years? That's not very long for the universe. I've been in the universe for 53 years. Does that mean I know everything? I only know 53 years is the stuff and only what I've been able to do so far. What if I want to learn something else? I just have to learn it. Do I know it? No, nope, because I haven't done it yet. Could I learn how to weld? Yeah. I could. I could learn anything. I just need more time. And I need someone to show me. Because I would probably burn myself. Ooh, look at Andrea's all done too. Je uh, Jasmine, are you all done? All done? Ready to do the black? Who else is ready for black? This pixie. Question. I got a question. Um, my dad, uh, my dad's younger brother is an artist and he's famous. <gasps> he, he's been in like about seven movies and he draws really good. See, drawing is like one of like, that's one of those things like super math geniuses. Their brains just know how to do it. I'm always impressed by that. But like, I love art, but I like to trace and stuff. I'm not afraid to trace. It's like, ooh, I'm an artist. Like, okay, but I'm still gonna trace, right? Cause it's, I, I'm a, I get nervous and I wanna ruin it, so I trace. Who's ready to do black? Um, but I have a question. Yes, question. And what happens if you like color on me? Line. Oh, we're going to make them black right now. As long as you can sort of see them, that's all we need. As long as you can tell where they're at. If you painted over them completely, I am not there to help you. So we just want we just want to make sure we can, they're like little roads. Okay, so put the lids on all your colors because we can use these to paint other things. I'm going to cover mine all up. Clip, clip, clip. So we're going to color the whole thing black and no, we're gonna we're gonna make like little roads. So here's my itty bitty paintbrush. It's dirty and I don't care because black could cover up everything. And I find my black paint. You guys ready? Okay, so first I want you to watch, then I say go. Okay? So I'm gonna get my blick. I'm gonna do it up close. Right? So remember that how we outline and we just push the paintbrush? Do we scribble? No. So watch me. I'm just gonna, and this tiny paintbrush, is this enough paint to make it all the way to the top? I'm gonna have to stop at halfway and get more paint. It is the law, right? So I get black paint, poke, and I just, and I flat, flat, put my paintbrush on it, my paintbrush goes, boop, and it opens to the exact size of that black line. Watch, I just land. Boop, and I push, ran out at halfway. Whatever, poke. And I land right on it and push. Is mine perfectly smooth? It's a little bit waggly. Is that bad? No, because you know why? I have a human brain and human brains can't be perfectly straight because we're connected to muscle and stuff. So we, without a ruler, you can't be straight. Okay, so I just go more black 
And I go, okay, let me drive on this road. Oh, that one I made it all the way. I just push my paintbrush. Do I wiggle? Do I pick up my paintbrush and scribble because I had more paint on the backside? No. I just poke my black paint and push. How about the top sides? Yes. Like a roller coaster. Woo. It's not enough paint. Halfway, I ran out of black. Ugh. And we. It's almost like, look at all the ratty parts where I got outside the lines. The black lines are fixing it. I am so lucky. And now you can hold it like a pencil. Look, everybody, look. Look at me. Look. I hold like a pencil and I'm near that metal. How come? I have more control. If I hold my paintbrush back here, it goes, what? So I hold it by the closer to the metal and I just push. Oop. Halfway, I ran out. One more time. Turn the corner. Turn the corner. It's exactly one paintbrush thick. Um, Miss Pixie? Yes. Um, my iPad is about to die. Okay, well, let's. Okay, you just wash out your paintbrushes, put the lids on, and watch the uh, the YouTube video. Um. When your 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 thing is all charged up, okay? Okay. It's not an emergency. It just means you have to push pause. Just wash your paintbrushes so there's no paint, so they're smooth and they won't turn hard. Well, I can stay here for the next five minutes. I probably have until it dies, but um, yeah. Yeah. Okay, now I get to do the other side. I just put. Push, run out. Push, turn the corner. Who feels like now that you've done a couple lines, this makes sense? You're just driving your car on the road. And it's smoothing out your edges on your windows. I gotta put it down. I'm starting to drop it. Okay. Can you see mine okay? Poke. I just push. thinks it's pretty li look doesn't it look more bold higher contrast look at the colors against the black so bold are we scribbling no we push drive the car it makes a smoother line just like when we were outlining our butterfly with the turquoise and push Keep having to stop again. I always think the paint lasts longer than it's, and I think, and no, it lasts about three inches, and I have to get more. Poop. I think it's a marker every time. Tanya, you have a question? Tanya? Yeah. Tanya. I'm good yourself. Um, you know what that blurred? Ask that again. You know when you were making like engine sounds? Oh, uh, yeah? You totally can. Uh, like that? Uh, kind, of like, kind of like you're passing down Butterfly Street. The Butterfly Street? Yeah. That was going by fast. But see, I didn't pick up my paintbrush and I didn't wiggle. That's how they stay smooth. But I have to stop constantly. More paint. Kind of annoying. Stop! Aren't you surprised at how smooth your lines are? Look how well you're doing. What? Like, oh, I can't outline in paint. I'll mess it up. Did you? No. 
So where'd that thought come from? What? The thought is fear that you might, but no, you didn't. Stuff happens sometimes because we're on earth, but you can't predict like that. This is earth. Very unpredictable. I finished. I finished. And you didn't. Ha ha. Hmm. Oh, most of you are done now. <laughs> You're almost done though, I can tell. You know what I'm going to do while you guys are busy? I'm going to go back and look. You remember those little white spots that can appear? I'm going to go hunting for the little white thing. There's one. Okay. Oh, look it! Yours is all done tonight. Nice. Nice. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Aren't you more impressed with it now? Like you thought you had beautiful windows and now you're like, this is good. Mm. Good job. I'm watching you. Oh, look it. And I like how, look how, look how you know exactly how much paint to get and how hard to push. Look how fast you learn that. You're pushing just the right hardness to open your paintbrush to just the right amount. And then you push. You're like, how did you learn that? Did I tell you that? No. Your hand learned it all by itself. Because you have a good brain. And good brains are like, I don't get it. I don't get it. They figure it out. So when you feel done with that outline, can we outline the rest of the butterfly? Look at my butter, everybody push pause. I totally went over right here on my, oh, I'm gonna have to fix all that with the black, but I'm just gonna put a black outline so I know where not to paint. So oh, that's fine, I could do that outline. And I, I just put it on the black line and I'm cut, the butterfly is on top of the turquoise, right? Cause the butterfly is in front. So I'm not afraid to get the black on the turquoise because my butterfly is in front of the background. So my but my black should be in front of the turquoise. That's why you put the turquoise on first. It only lasts like four inches and I have to get more. I keep saying that because it annoys me. Whoosh. Hey, weird. Look at my butterfly. One, one's hanging down lower than another one. How did I do that? I don't know. I'm kind of holding on to... Oh, Tanaya, you have a question? The little windows yeah. yeah we're gonna paint it all black look so everything that isn't a window becomes black but if we outline it first you're less likely to go outside the lines okay good that was smart because that's what we do next you're doing predicting huh Whoops, I'm not able to do that. I gotta stand in front of it this time. Okay, <laughs> my arm is wiggling. There. Okay, everybody look, class, class, look. Everybody pause, push pause, pause. I know you're busy. Okay, so everything that isn't a window is black, right? So I'm gonna use my little paintbrush for all these little tiny pieces. But what about in here? Could I just use this bigger one for the bigger areas? 
Yeah, but I'm gonna use little paint breasts because she's tiny for all these itty bitty triangles, right? And then when I need to, I can switch to this bigger one, right? But first I'm gonna go hunting with my, and I like to hold my cup, you know why? Cause I have to go poke color, poke color, right? So it just seems closer to do it like this. Hope somebody has a question, go ahead. Oh, Leslie? Oh yes, I, we just haven't done it together yet. Cause I just wanted to do it together. Cause Margaret, it, do you have a question? Um, um if you were painting, um, and you run out of paint, switch to the other side of the paintbrush. That is absolutely true. Very good you observation. Also really yes, that one should so Watch the video later, okay? It takes me about two hours to uh, make a video and then upload it to YouTube. So I have a slow phone. Okay, so this is black paint, right? Remember when we did the background and we had to paint it twice? Look, I don't know if you can see my black, but there are tons of little white things. I'm going to go back over it gently and make sure I go hunting for all those little white see-through things. After I painted it, sure enough, here they come. Okay, there. Question? Oh, I thought I saw a question. Maybe my little paintbrush can do the whole thing. I don't know. We have the big paintbrush, but I, I don't want to use it because it, remember how big it opens? It spreads open humongous. I don't want to use it because it might ruin my windows. So as long as it's little, I'm going to use my little paintbrush. Oh, see, here's those little white things peeking through. There they are. Here they come. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Isn't that weird how we outlined it and now your brain is not hurting, it's just staying in the lines because we have a human kind of brain? I see a hand. Yes. Uh, Shane, did you have a, a question? Were you just holding your paintbrush? No? Okay, uh, Fabian, um, question? Sorry, Fabian first. Go ahead, Fabian. Um, what do you do if you're almost done with that color? If you're done with the black? Pin your waiting again, Mr. Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> Yes, and then I thought this little paintbrush might be too small, and we could switch to the bigger paintbrush with the black. But you decide. Mm -hmm. You decide. Because we have to wash our, our big paintbrush again once we get black on it. This is kind of annoying with the little paintbrush. I, I know I've already said it. I don't like to stop and get more paint every second. <laughs> Uh, your mic is on the mute. You can ask her if you have a question. Question. Uh, who can I paint with the, the big brush but use it like a pencil? Yes. And then I'll show you. I'm all done with little paintbrush. So here's big paintbrush. But remember that outlining trick? Here's my black. What am I going to do? I'm going to go underneath the line. Smash. Sneak up. It's that same trick. I don't hurt nothing. And then I'm above the line. No hurtsies. Whoop. Whoop. Okay, there. But I definitely want to go hunting for little white spots because I don't like them. Now I'm going to go hunting. Mm-hmm. And only after it starts to dry does the little white spots show up. It's so weird. 
And they're like, yep, there you are. You try to sneak in there, you little white fleckles. Okay. So everybody pause. Everybody pause. Oh, I have a question. Um, Marielle, yes? It's the artist in me. The artist in me. Yeah. Okay, now everybody pause. I know you're busy, but I'm gonna show you how to make a head. Okay, so we're not gonna make it with our paintbrush. Everybody pause, even though you're busy. Push pause, pause. Stop painting, Grace. Okay, watch. So fingerprint your head. Why? Because your fingerprint is a perfect round circle. If we did it with our paintbrush, we'd go, oops, I did it too big, oops, I did it too big, oops, I did it too great. But this will be just the right size. So I put my finger in there. What? Look at it. It's perfectly round. And it makes a perfectly round head. And then you have to lick it off. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Use a napkin. See? Now he's happy. Okay, and everybody push pause again. Push pause and look up. Antennas. Right? Antennas. They're little curly sixes or G's. We know how to draw a six or G. And this is paint. Can we do it twice? One time only. It's paint. Right? So we get our black paint. And do we pick up our paintbrush or scribble? No. We just want them smooth. So I poke my paint. And I jump up and I just try to make a six or a G depending on how they turn. I jump up, straight up, and curl. However they come out is how they come out. Don't fix them. They're wild animals. Who cares? I just go straight up, wee, and spin. Did I scribble or anything? No, I just went wee, just like when I was doing my outlines of my windows. Wee. Who feels good about it? Doesn't the black make it look bold? I know. Wait, what do we have left? What do the white dots do to it? Doesn't the white dots, it's the extreme of contrast, I mean black against white, makes our brain go, what? Right? And look how they're two fingers apart. All my white dot, big white dots are two fingers apart, right? And I'm, I'm gonna use my finger, just like when I put the head on there. So everybody push pause, even though you're not at this part, push pause, and I get my white paint, fingerprint. And first, I'm gonna put, watch me do it. I put five falling down but they're two fingers apart. So I go one, two, three, four, five. Now you do it. Hey, do I swirl it like this? No, the black is wet. That will just make gray. So just touch. Now you do it when you're ready. What if you miss this part? And eh, rewind, rewind it on a YouTube video, right? Oh. What about down the side again? Five times. One, space, two, three, four, five. Hey, it's like a pattern. Fingerprints, perfectly round little dots. When you run out of paint, it's not a circle anymore. That's when you know. Because it's a lot of paint on the end of your finger, it's nice and round. Okay, the other side. Five falling down towards her head. One, two, three, four, five. And there's one, two finger space, two finger space. Okay, how about down the side this way? Five more times. One, two, Three, four, five. Doesn't the white help? It's softening the black and they look like diamonds. 
but I'm not print like a stamp. The paintbrush would be like swirly, swirly, make gray. Okay, oh, how about the bottom? It's like a smile down here. Five more times. One, two, three, four, five. Like a smile. One, two, three, four, five. Fingerprint. Well, you know who's jealous? Up here in the corner, corner didn't get one. Look at this, everybody pause. <gasps> Think, I'm jealous. There. Isn't that fun? Now what does mine have that yours doesn't have now? What's in between each one of those, right? Those are like teeny tiny fingerprints, except for my finger is not that small. What if we use the teeny tiny paintbrush stick? Not this, it's filthy. I use my stick, like an itty bitty fingerprint. And I get my white, and it's two little hops in between each one, so I go. And you have to get paint each time, or they're not round. So I go, one, two, one, two, more paint. How come I have to get more paint all the time? Or they're not round. More paint. One, two, one, two, more paint. One, two, one, two, more paint. Boop, boop. Dinky dink, dinky dink, dinky dink. Hop, hop, pokey poke. More paint. Doesn't that look good? The little diamondy parts, little sparkly sparkles. I mean, if these were diamonds, we'd be rich. But it's pretty. Ta-da! Oh my gosh! Look at my, my tummy. I want to show you my butterfly tummy. It's drying. Can you guys see all that white stuff showing through? What? Definitely right here. Wherever I didn't put it on thick enough at all these white. Not here. I can't fix any of that anymore because I'll hurt my dots. But I'm just going to get my little paint, like my baby paintbrush. Just go hunting again. Bye. Bye, little white. Get out of here. Bye. Ooh, I'm bullying the white dots. Name. More black. Boop, boop. That fits. Oh, there's one. Get it, get it, get it. There's one. And there's one. Oop. When it starts to dry and where you can see them and because the shininess of the paint you think oh I totally did a good job and then it dries and you're like what the what oh I found some I did a good job. Who feels good about it now that it has all the extras? Remember how thought you, you thought, oh, mine looks good when it was just the windows in the background? Now look at it. Now, now look at the original and look at yours. What? You, you did that on your first painting try? What? Have you ever painted a butterfly before? But remember, remember those of you who want to choose your own colors? Remember choosing your own colors? You could probably do that uh, with the three colors, right? You could probably do that. But this was my design using those opposite color theory. Okay, show me your paintings. Yeah. Um, you're gonna, can you like take a picture? Yes. Oh, look at that. 
Yes, I want to take a picture. Good job. Okay, and we did so good.